Hey, how's it going, guys? Double Jolt here. Today we're gonna play The Godfather 2, and I love The Godfather 1. If you've never played it, you definitely should. The Godfather 1 was so nostalgic for me right now because I played that game when I pretty much first got my Xbox for a few years, to be fair. I actually never did finish it until about maybe a few years ago. I'd always just play and then somehow get my like gamer card banned and then I'd have to make a new one then I'd just start again in a few months but yeah Godfather 1 was so good and then the Godfather 2 came out and that was pretty good as well because it intertwined sort of strategy gameplay with owning your own mob and the first person shooter aspect the first person I ever called Godfather which is great was Vito Corleone but yeah we started a series a about times. maybe 2011, I and I only did about six episodes on it, so I'm going to redo my series, this we time I'm going to stick with it and actually finish the whole game. I'm sorry for talking over cutscenes and everything, but I just wanted to say that. Back while the dawn recovered and paid the price. Michael, the youngest brother behind Fredo, took over the reins. He and Tom led a war against the five families. They pulled the strings, and my boss, Aldo Trapani, pulled the trigger. He's Michael's right-hand man now, running the family in New York. These days, opportunity is everywhere. But so are new families, fighting for their share. It took a man like Hyman Roth to get everyone to the table. We're gonna divide up Cuba, get richer than we ever could back in the States. This'll be good for the family, and for me. My name is Dominic. How should we customize him? Oh god, definitely not this. These hairstyles are really bad. What hairstyle says Dominic? This one, of course. Or should we go with the Lex Luthor? I still remember playing this for like the second or third time around. Uh, intro so long. <laughs> it's so long to do these days. My age had better be correct. I am always accurate about My, my guy age. looks pretty shabby. Me live to 100, Mr. Roth. Congratulations. Cheers. Cheers. Salute. Well, the doctors might disagree, but what do they know? <laughs> These are wonderful things we've achieved in Cuba. This government knows how to help business to encourage it. The hotels here are bigger and swankier than any of the rug joints we put up in Vegas. Not all hotels. <laughs> Michael Corleone's accepted, of course. But the point I'm making is this, that now we have what we have always needed, real partnership with a government. Salute. Cheers. Salute. And at the time of my retirement, I turn over all my interests in the Cuba operation to you, my partners. To the Corleone family and Aldo Trapani, the Hotel Capri. Grazie. The Nationale will go to Rico Granados and the Sevilla Biltmore to Samuel Mangano, here with us all the way from Sicily. The rest of you will also share in handling my non-casino operations. Gentlemen, rebels and petty criminals are Cuba's past. We are its future. Lachaim. Gendan, salute. Nobody had that cake. It's really disrespectful. Not a waste of cake. Fredo, you're just like your brother. You're smart. What's on your mind, Dominic? How you enjoying Cuba? It's great, Michael. Yeah, it's great, Michael. I like the little things here, you know? Nice change of pace from New York. That's good. When this deal is done, we're gonna do great things in this country. Tomorrow's a new year, my friend. The start of a new future for the Corleone family. Salud. To the future. By the way, where did Aldo go? He went downstairs for the New Year's celebration. You should talk to him. Make sure everything is set for tomorrow's meeting. 
Now we have to go find Aldo. Oh yes, we at least I run really fucking fast. Holy shit, he runs like Usain Bolt. Where the fuck Aldo at? Do I have to go down even more? God damn it, Aldo. Lucky my guy speeding Gonzalo as fuck. Boss, you alright? Michael wanted me to make sure that everything's set for tomorrow's meeting. Don't worry about it, Dominic. It's taken care of. I'm just anxious to get back to New York. I don't like it here. I don't trust what the president says, you know, about the rebels. I just want to get out of here. Don't worry, Aldo. Come on, Aldo. You really think the rebels are going to be a problem? Yeah, I do. You know what I saw on my way over here? I saw a rebel being arrested. And instead of being taken alive, he exploded a grenade hidden in his jacket. They can win. I'm done. Michael, Fredo, the countdown's about to start. Aldo, is everything set for tomorrow's meeting? Of course, Michael, don't worry about it. I'm pretty sure if I remember this, we start getting shot up here. Senor, or a bomb Senor, goes off. Due to serious setbacks to our troops in Guantanamo and San Diego, it? My position in Cuba is untenable. Who do you think you are? You are a peasant. Look how sassy my guy looks. Mm-hmm. He's strutting his thing. So I'm doing fuck. I'm gonna quickly put subtitles on. Okay, I press start. What is this? No, we don't want to do a Don's view. Maybe it's select. Yes. Okay, it looks like there is no subtitles. Nope, no subtitles. I wish you all good luck. There's a plane waiting for us. Go, don't make a big deal. I gotta make it to the plane. Oh shit, I can oh that's my face. Okay, I get I get a fight. Left punch, right punch. Right Simple enough. Grab his arm. Don't let him hit me like that. Oh, he just got knocked down. Ah! Okay. It sounds like a huge. Oh, I'm gonna smack your head in this stove. Smack it. Smack it. There we go. Oh yes, burn his face. Mmm, smells like roast beef, bitch. What is he dropping? Shit, he had like four dolls on him. Oh, rich bitch. That elbow. Where did where did I get a pistol from? Why are you glowing? Am I meant to kill you? No. Oh, it's really stiff. I got. Oh, I have to go to select. Don't. I have to put my sensitivity up. So, so slow. Okay, it's a bit better. You better stop that. If I remember correctly, a load of them come out from here. No! You just killed him! Oh, he's not dead, he's just on fire. It's all good then. Okay, LT to lock and then I wanna know how to crouch. Okay, I've done it. Pow! Pow! Pow, right in your head! You no fuck him. I'm sh shooting guys really far away. Accuracy is really bad with this gun. Bang right in his face. Follow me. Give me collect money as I do this. Oh god. Stop that. No. Get the guy in front of you. Stop shooting me, sir. You're standing on fire. How are you doing that? I can stand on fucking crouching fire. Okay. Makes sense again. I just really want to kill them. Who is he fighting? He's kicking a wall. Okay. Ah, so slow. Okay, I killed him. Let's go, guys. Follow me. Alright, this 
two million. Got you. I can't remember if you can actually upgrade your like shooting skills and everything with accuracy. Or is it certain guns that just do better than the others? I actually can't remember. It looked like she was a hot dog from GTA. Stop kicking the door! Stop it! Stop! Ugh. Oh shit, I killed him. Okay. I just really wanted to fire a warning shot at him. God, he should have listened and sort of stopped kicking. Stop! Hitting a burning car. That's what I thought, you know, to run. It's vandalism, that's illegal. Haha, <laughs> he died. The guy that was hitting the car died. Oh, shit. It's not safe. It's not safe here. I don't like it. Let me get out of Cuba. Need a better gun. <laughs> oh, shit, I got a shotgun. Ow! You guys are kicking a cement cylinder, you realize that, don't you? Fuck off hitting the cylinder. Oh, you bitch! Oh, shit, I punched on you. You bitch! Oh, God, you're getting in the way, pink girl. It's this one I have a problem with. Kill her. Hit. Oh, you've seen too much, you have to die now. Okay, I gotta go. She saw too much, I had to. I couldn't just up, leave a loose end like that. Oh yeah, in this game, certain people have special abilities, so you can have you can make a crew, of, I think, of like three people that actually follow you around. But you can have a whole gang, and certain people in your gang can have abilities, like he's an arsonist. Or a safe cracker. No, he's a safe cracker. There's people who are arsonists who are like firing TNT, there's a gun specialist, sniper. All that good stuff where they will have skills. I don't know why he had a blowtorch in Peru. Or Cuba, sorry, Cuba. Cuba. I don't know how he got that through customs to break down that fence. trying to get out. But I bet my guy's Look, so glad Jesus, he did. There's so many of them. Michael, I'm sorry. Aldo. Aldo was family. I can help. When we get back to New York... I want you to make sure his mother's taken care of. Okay, Mikey. Okay. What do we do now? Roth's plan for Cuba was the one thing keeping the families from tearing at each other's throats. We needed this country. You don't think the rebels are gonna win? They've already won, Fredo. Michael. I mean, what do we do now? Our family. What about us? Nobody was going to touch New York while Aldo was in charge. Everyone will want a peace now. His own men will probably turn on each other if they think it's to their advantage. It's only a few of them I trust anyway. But I trust you with my life. Dominic, I want you to be boss. And I want you to have your own family. I trust that you can run New York, Dominic. You can do this for me. Yes, Michael. Oh, yes, Michael, I will. That was my creepy voice. Galeon Compound, New York. Don't you come or out? Out for good. Took what they had, started their own gangs. Took what we had? It's Hyman Roth in Florida. He's backing up those sons He looks like a really angry lawyer. The Rosados never had the Colleoni. And now what? They're taking over, taking hostages. Not without help. Not without Roth. Frank, Hyman Roth isn't a part of this. Mikey's right, Frank. The Rosado brothers always been angry. Ever since Clemenza died. No, no, that was no heart attack. In any case, that's the situation. We know they're running sanitation and construction, and we know Carmine's fixing fights. Yeah, and who's too? Ain't that Roth's game? And La Vegana? Junk, dope. I want him dead. Frank. You turn to a right diva, Frank, when you've not had your Snickers. I've been loyal to this family for years. I know, Michael. But after Cuba, my business with Hyman Roth is very important. These accusations aren't fair to him or me. Fair. You give your loyalty to him before your own blood. Come on, Frankie. 
You know my father did business with Hyman Roth. He respected him. Your father did business with Hyman Roth. Your father respected Hyman Roth. But your father never trusted Hyman Roth. Are you through? Dun dun dun. Good. Dominic, stay focused on the Rosado brothers. Carmine's weak. Always has been. Send them a message. Prove to me that I was right about you. I am right. I mean, you are right about me. Well, guys, I think that's going to complete episode one of our new Let's Play. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do give the video a like because it helps me out. And I will see you in part two.